My name is Charles Kelleher. I'm 64 years of age. I'm married to Stella. We have three adult children. Back in 2002, I was 51 at the time, I had been experiencing some difficulty uh, having a satisfactory bowel movement. As it turned out, by pure coincidence, I had an appointment with a surgeon to uh, have just a little cyst removed from my neck. It had nothing to do with cancer. Regarding my bowel difficulties, uh, my family doctor arranged for me to, uh, to have a barium enema. So while I was visiting the surgeon, I also mentioned about the problems I was have going to the bathroom. He said, well, we'll arrange for a test at the hospital called a, a scope. He received the results of the test from my barium enema. Obviously was concerned because on a Friday afternoon when I was going to one of my children's basketball games, the phone rang, it was the doctor's office. And he said, uh, that test I was going to do in December, I think we'll do it next week. I, of course, was concerned. I said, why? What seems to be the issue? I'm not so sure he wanted to uh, discuss it over the phone, and I don't blame him. But he said, well, I received the results of your barium enema test, and it's possible you might have cancer. So I went to the hospital early the next week. He performed the test, and uh, sure enough, he determined there was a a tumor in my bowel. What it does uh, to the family is makes you sit back and re-examine, you know, what's, what's our future going to be like, uh, you know, to, to the worst, if you will, uh, to, uh, you know, how this, this is obviously going to change our life. Uh, from here on in, it's not going to be like it was up to this point in time. A lot of people think that, well, cancer is something that everyone else gets or every other family experiences. And, uh, and I've often said it's, it's a bit like the dartboard. The patient is the bullseye and uh, uh, the patient is told uh, he or she has cancer. But then you get to the smaller, the smaller ring in the dartboard and the family is affected. And another bigger ring, your, your, your extended family and your close friends. But in reality, it, this disease affects the entire community. The work that has been achieved over the past 25 years through research in, in developing treatments, not necessarily cures, but treatments for cancer has been phenomenal. When people donate to an organization like the Cancer Society and, uh, and this money is used towards research and advancing not only the cure, but the treatment of cancer. Um, I believe I'm an example of, of, of just how that money is used so well to advance the fight against cancer. My name is Charles Kelleher, and I am living proof that donating to health partners works.